Hello everyone and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. Last time we climbed our way up Tenku Island and now we have an army to take back Yafutoma. This time we're going to take back Yafutoma. Partially. <laughs> Um, this is probably going to be split into a couple episodes. I forget if I get a chance to save or not. Hey, you can't expect to fight in that ship. Come ride with me on my ship. All ships, prepare for battle. We must take back Yafutoma. I love this moment. Just sort of like, oh yeah, we have an army. <laughs> I don't know why the cloud filter is there. Our scouts have reported that the Armada and the Yafutoman fleet are patrolling Kazai Lake. Vise, your ship is also patrolling with the Armada. Now it's personal! Haha, <laughs> I understand your frustration. If we can get your ship back, we can win this. The Tenku will attack the Armada from the front and keep them distracted. While they're keeping the Armada busy, I want you to get to the get the Delphinus back. Without the Delphinus, we don't stand a chance. Sounds like a plan. Alright men, get ready. Let's show them what the Tenku can do. Do we see it? Do we see Beleza's ship, the Lynx? The Delphinus? And... Vigoro's ship. Ha ha ha, it looks like our pirate friends want some action. Things just got a little more interesting. I'm coming for you, Red. Soon you'll be all mine. <laughs> the Westerner's ship is nice. Very nice. I think I am going to enjoy this. But I never dreamed that I would be able to kill Prince Daigo so soon. Now Moegi will be mine for sure. As well as the throne. <laughs> He's a little shit. I'm sorry, handsome. I didn't want to have to fight you. But for Valua and Lord Galcian, I must. Tenko ship, straight ahead! They are in range of our cannons! Alright, everyone, listen up. This is it. If we win this battle, we will rule the east. Let them feel the power of the Valuan armada. Fire at will! I actually like this. I like that it is showing an actual, like, ship battle. And there's Vigoro's big dumb ship. God, I, I, this just makes me think of, like, space shooters and things. So far, the battle is even. We're more maneuverable, but we can't seem to break their lines. Vise, keep an eye out for your ship. It's gotta be around here somewhere. All right, everyone be ready for action. When we find the Delphinus, let's take it back. Air pirate style. How fair is the battle? My lord, the Tenku are swarming all around the Valuans, but the Armada is holding their position. We seem to be at a stalemate. Heh <laughs> heh, I see very well. It is time for us to join the battle and end this. Once and for all. Hmm. We can't break their lines and our ships are taking serious damage. I don't think we can take much more of this. I'm going to give the signal to retreat. My lord, a ship fitting the description of Captain Vise's ship is heading our way. What? Are you sure? Yes, my lord. I'm positive it's a Delphinus. Daigo, if you can get us close to the Delphinus, we can take it back and win this thing. We're air pirates, remember? We do this stuff all the time. All you have to do is get us close. Haha, <laughs> I see. Okay, Vise, you got it. We're going to have to jump to the deck. Huh? It's okay. I got you, Fina. Uh -huh. I'll be right behind you. <laughs> For a 
Enrique! I guess they were expecting us. Let's throw these goons off our ship. And now it begins. This is probably one of the more interesting things that happens. During a lot of the ship battles on the Delphinus, it will have a varying degree of actual battle damage. It's a nice touch that really will come into play later, especially with how some of the fights go. Basically, you can assume, were you just in a giant ship battle, the Delphinus is going to have some damage on it. And we're just going to Cutlass Fury these guys. Uh, these ones aren't that big of threats. You still want to be careful, as with any enemy at this point, but you can take a little bit of a breather. Well, that was contradictory. I just realized that. Oh god, that guy's countering. I don't think we attacked him. We did not... I love how everyone has just blade beams. Bonk. I, I love Cupel Spike. It's probably one of my more favorite items that Fina gets as a weapon. Okay. And nuke. And just like that, they're dealt with. Not, they're not the hardest enemies. It's just like... There could be, there could be tougher. Also, now we get to run around the Delphinus. Uh, you want to be sure to heal. Just between everything. Uh, this is, I think, coming up to the end of the base uh, on ground battles. But you should still play a little carefully. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, the alarms. Damn, that's going to take some buffing out. And the ship is in lockdown. Of course, I can't get through here perfectly. Well, I think this encounter happens regardless. Uh, yeah, this encounter definitely happens regardless. Uh, hmm. Try to think here. If I just attack everyone, get some get some damage off. Probably get a counter-attack or two. Oh god, grenade. I don't think I ever said it. I love the end of battle jingle. Okay, I do get a chance to heal. Then Vise is the out-of-battle healing, because everything is in fixed amounts. God, it's that's just like the best thing. Like, it's super good. Miraji, we'll be taking back our ship now. Do, do you think I'm afraid of you? They aren't scary. Why are you fools just standing there? Get them! You betray those that trust you and needlessly endanger the lives of innocent people, all for your own personal gain. For the honor of Princess Moegi and for the people of Yafutoma, I will strike you down. Face my blade, coward. Enrique's pretty good. He's a pretty good guy. It's also why I like the character. Just like I think this was sort of where it started for me that I liked Enrique. First off, always take out the additional enemies. And where is it? There's Cliff of Might. I want Cliff of Speed, though. Because... Uh, 
Yeah, no, I want to get the Increm. Does Enrique know what he does? Use that on Fina. Hoping that would go off sooner. Okay. And now we have to see the problem. Miraji's a bit of a magic boss, and unfortunately, this leave is kind of makes him tedious to deal with. Give me strength. Let's try this. And speed boost. And oh, good! That only hits one person. Do, 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 do. Stop using wind slash, you fucking assholes! Yep, do that, and then Sacrum Crystal, and then just attack. Have Enrique focus on Mirage. Make it, like, play into the whole personal duel thing. Let's try this. And Sacrum Crystals continue to be the best health item outside of need somebody to be from zero to full in one second. Damn, son. Laser sword! Yeah, the, this is what I mean by the tight fight being tedious. Oh, it does hit more than one person. Shit. The fight's tedious because then he does this. I think this means I can... Drill nose him? No, um, let's have Vise use Increm. What am I doing? Vise attacks and takes out other soldier. Aika Drillins and hopes that works. Fina, Increms, and Enrique. And Enrique attacks Mirage. Ah, uh, damn it, I think I attacked that guy. Hoping this works. So I can get rid of his buff, that would be amazing. Don't think it worked. Oh, it did! It did! Yes! Ah, oh, I was so close. So close. Well, this fight's over now. Uh, Miraji will be taking a lot of damage. <laughs> Very fast. I don't think that works because Drillin affects him. Yeah! Prepare yourself. <laughs> Damn it. Oh my! <laughs> oh my god. I did I forgot Enrique has the blade of slumber. Let's just knock out the soldier. Okay, or Ike can kill him one hit with critical. That's fine. How vise. Death. 609. Oh. Oh, this boy is about to have the worst day. Over there. And uh, truthfully, I have lost to this guy because he got off the increm. Oh my god! 
you got up the Increm, and I did not get the buffs up because I never used them in the original playthroughs. But with buffs, you can see how powerful this is. Bum, 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 magic do is really good. However, I believe we're going to be thrown into another battle right away. Um, I know. Um, help! Uh, I'll give back your ship. Just, just spare my life. Please let me live. You're too pitiful for me to run you through. I'll spare you, but you'll pay for all your treachery. All right, we got the Delphinus back. Now let's even the odds. There's a ship coming in from the starboard side. It's coming in fast. <sighs> the Draco. There's something about it that disgusts me. That ship. It's the Draco. It's Vigoro's ship. Talk about trying to compensate! That guy's got a complex. The Armada is being led by Beleza and Vigoro. If we can take out their ships, the rest of them will fall. Our next target, the Draco. 